Hey, I'm Chief from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Free Random Games. A series where I find some of the most random games out there on the internet, and I play them for you right here in this video. I can't promise that they're gonna be any good, but I can promise that we're gonna have some fun, so if you guys cool with that, you down with that. Everybody get ready and buckle up, because here we go! First game we have of today's episode is called Map Friend. We are on a map search engine, and I think we're supposed to just like go to places. Hey everybody, Future Jay here. I have to explain that ass explanation of Jay just introducing this first game and the low energy that came with it. I apologize for that. I wish I could slap past Jay in the face. But basically, right before I started recording this, I was in front of my house and a random ass cat came up to me and started meowing. It was like meow. And I was like, what the hell is your problem? Stop meowing right in front of me. Like, disrespecting me like that in front of my own freaking house. The cat was, I don't know, looking for something? I don't even know. It was just looking for something. And then started, like, zigzagging around my legs. Like, making a figure eight around my legs. And I am super allergic to cats. So, I had a crazy allergic reaction. And then I took some Benadryl. And then I realized that Benadryl makes you drowsy. So I was starting to feel the drowsy effects as I was recording this. So maybe the first game is going to have low energy. I ended up going to sleep right after I recorded this. But the other two games are just regular Jay. But this first game is actually pretty good. So I wanted to keep this in here. So I just wanted to explain the energy levels and me not explaining things correctly. Because I was um, having an allergy reaction. And then I ended up taking some Benadryl. So I was a little drowsy. Anyway, no more explaining. Back to the episode. So we're in Westwater, Illinois. I'm sorry that I'm horrible at explaining games, but yeah. We're at Westwater, Illinois. I'm pretty sure we all don't know where that is. Not even people who are from Westwater, Illinois. And I think I can drop this person right here. There you go. Right now we're in the middle of the ocean. Did you know? Click on a location to go there. Exploring is fun with Map Friend. It better be fun. Or else. I promised everybody that we're gonna have some fun. So if we're not having fun, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you and your entire family. You need to explore orbs to fly to new locations. This help keep costs down. I don't give a damn about your costs or keeping it down. So we backed out. Let me go here real quick. Let's see what's on this little piece of land. So there's some trees. We're on a beach. That's cute, I guess. I guess we just keep exploring until we see something weird. I think that's what this game's about, everybody. I have no idea. If there's going to be a jump scare, my heart is ready for it. JoshNatureReview.com. Definite top 10 forest in Illinois State. Willow Forest. I put this relatively unknown forest on number 5. Willow Forest is actually really beautiful in spring. It's not super big, but it's worth the excursion. Especially the views on Westwater Lake are great from here. I go with my family every now and then, so be sure to let me know if you're going. Who? Oh! The heck was that? Oh, give me that. We have one out of three orbs. Great exploring. Collect more explore orbs to travel to new locations. Okay, I think this is the next thing that we need. Willow Beach Road. Willow Beach is located on the shores of Lake Westwater. The closest town is Westwater Township as of the 2004 census. Its population was 567 and contained 280 housing units. The town is most known for the infamous Petersburg Airstrip where the... And then it just cut off. Okay, so in order to get orbs, we just have to click on the information of the locations that we're visiting. Okay, got it. So let me back out real quick. Now that I officially know what to do. Let's see the details of this shit. Boom. This says no info on this location. Maybe something's wrong. I think you're looking for somewhere else. Location missing. That's weird. Give me that orb. That kind of gave me the chills for some reason. Hey, you found another orb. Let me search for new places. That's weird that this isn't on the map. That's actually kind of creepy. What do you want me to type in? Um, huh? Adcare DZ? What the hell's Adcare DZ? Where are we flying to now? I think we need to fly to the FBI because I see some random blood right here. Let me drop this down here. Oh, this is not random blood. What the fuck? No info on this location. Why are you looking here? Wasn't it in a... What? Wasn't it in a forest? Oh, this is creepy as shit. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Gotcha. Okay, where the hell are we? Look like somewhere where they would be like fighting on Star Wars or something. 
Hold on, I see something right there. There's something weird here. It says something about, like, didn't it happen in a forest? This got really interesting. According to... What? According to what? It just said according to, and then it just stopped me. According to... Come on, man. Let me see it one more time. According to... It said according to reports of crashes. Something reports of crashes, very rare. In fact, the fatality record is low compared to most company CEO John Slater's said in a statement we're very concerned about the recent accident but we ensure to our customers that we and then that was it okay so something about crashes and in a forest that's what I'm getting here I don't think this was on my Sunday night bingo card but let me back out of here. I'm assuming that there was a plane crash or something. What is this? Hold on. Let me go right here. This is where I just was, huh? Yeah, this is where I just was. Okay. That's definitely blood. This looks like... Like a wall or something. Or like a door. I'm just waiting for like a face to pop up or something. The N6 runs between North Africa, bordered by the Mediterranean Sea in the North and West African border by the Atlantic Ocean. What the heck is happening? Wait, 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 wait. Give me that. Okay, let's search for a new place, everybody. It's hard to read when the text keeps going back and forth, but let's see what the next location is. And then it's gonna say, HELL! Oh, it's actually a specific place. Okay. What is happening? Is that a plane? The crosswinds were steady at 20 knots. Now it's 30 knots. I do not want to know what this is about. Hold on. We're going to go here. It says, where are you going? I don't know where I'm going. We're under a plane. Did you know it should have been you? My game just completely went. So a little fun fact about this game, everybody. If you copy the coordinates and paste them into Google or whatever search engine you use, articles of has this Google map sleuth actually found missing flight MH370 in Cambodia. If you guys don't know about that flight, it was a flight where a plane from Malaysia Airlines was gonna fly out from Kuala Lumpur to Beijing, China. And then a little after, I think like 30 something minutes, they lost contact with like the radio tower or it was the last time the pilot spoke to the people and they never found the plane again supposedly it was the deadliest like disappearance or the deadliest crash of a plane in malaysian airlines history this is supposedly where the plane is actually located it's just a theory obviously and it's probably not even true but according to this article it says a british man is sticking to his claim that the missing malaysian airlines flight mh370 may be in the cambodian jungle after a chinese satellite firm disputed his find ian wilson now wants the site to be examined by helicopter so basically yeah right here this picture right here they're saying that this is where the crashed plane is and i think this is the exact same image as in the game right so yeah if you get these coordinates and you put them into google this is actually going to show up on google like articles to some guy who said this is where the plane is and yeah we don't actually know what that is but it obviously looks like a plane but i guess um like they're denying that it's the plane and maybe it's Photoshop. I don't know. People do really impressive things on Photoshop. But let me actually see if I can explore this a little bit. That must be the tip of the plane, right? Yeah, that's part of the plane, I think. That's creepy. That's super creepy. Oh, we can't go in the plane, but we can go on the plane. Why is this creepy as shit to me? I guess maybe because it's like an actual event. And you never know what actually happened to the plane. I can't even imagine, man. I don't even want to think about it. That's so scary. Especially when you're on long flights and you're going over the ocean. Like, that's terrifying to me. I hate it. I hate flying, but it's something that most people have to do. Especially if you want to, like, visit new countries and stuff. 
But flying has always made me feel uneasy because it's not like a natural thing. It says, where are you going right here? That's so creepy. But yeah, if you want to check out the articles yourself, just um, put in these coordinates or just type in like the missing plane. Um, they said it should have been you. Y'all see that? That's so weird that it says that. Why should it have been us? Next game, today's episode is called Momo the Game. This one actually looks promising because the graphics do look nice like this. We are starting off in this long dong hallway. It says press F to use flashlight. What? Okay, game. A little kinky, are we? I'm kidding. It did say flashlight, but you know how like the... Yo, why does Momo have some titties though? Why does Momo have some chechas, bro? Some tetas. Okay, let's go. Let's go inside here. Okay, that is actually kind of creepy. It's not that creepy. But that's a concussion if I ever heard one. Like, what else is she gonna do? Bang on the elevator door with her chicken feet? But yeah, what was that? It looked like she had like... Oh, goodness. Yeah, it looked like she had some, uh, take old bitties. I'll take that. Okay. Let's see what we got over here. This is why I like this game. Because it looks good. Can't do that. Okay. What's this? A security card is required to open the fire door. Gotcha. Um, I'm running out of battery pretty freaking quick. Momo is obviously somewhere here. Just don't know where. So I have to find a security card. Gotcha. But, damn. What the hell is Momo doing in this office, though? She ain't like that. You think she can hold down a job? She can't even hold a glass of water. I'm sorry, that wasn't nice. But am I wrong, though? I'm not wrong. Momo walks on her hands and feet. She has no hands. Ooh, yeah. But she's about to catch these hands. I'll punch her in her big-ass face. I don't give a damn. Watch me. If she comes here, I'm gonna punch her in her face. How do I open a door? I can't open this door. Let's just keep trying to look for uh, whatever we need. More batteries. I'm running out, though. I'm running out the juice. Ooh. Press C to use camera. Ooh. Okay. Oh, hell yeah. Battery heaven. What? I want those. I want those batteries. The fuck? Okay, we have a camera, though. The night vision sucks wiener. But wait. Um. Yeah, okay. I guess I have to use my flashlight and the camera at the exact same time. This says, please don't forget to water the plants. Don't forget to shut up, too. Okay, so far, I'm not seeing any key card. It's got to be in one of these offices. It's got to be. But I can't see anything. Shit is so freaking dark. It's not making any sense. Wait, is that something? Zero, light bulb, and ribbon. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's nothing. I thought maybe it would have been a code. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, double batteries, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Where the hell do I go? Oh shit, my camera battery ran out. Or my actual battery ran out. Well, there's more where that came from. Can I actually... Oh! I actually have an inventory. Duh! Okay, my bad, everybody. I didn't even know that. So now we got full batteries again. That's all that matters. Oh my! We got full battery again. Like I said, that's all that matters. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh. Holy shit. Okay. How do I get out of here? Wait. Wait, wait. Crouch. Hide behind this chair. Turn off the light. Do not come here. Do not come here. <gasps> oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God! No! Run, 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 run! Oh, I don't like that noise. Oh my god! I ran out of stamina. That was so freaking scary. That was so freaking scary. Oh man, I did not expect her to be that close. That hurt right here, everybody. That hurt right here in the place where my heart should be. Oh man, that was so terrifying. Okay. So, now that I know that we can do the batteries like that, nothing is going to stop me. Nothing is going to get in my way, except Momo. So, I need to find a card reader 
for this thing right here so we can exit through the fire escape. But it's pretty much going to be in one of these offices, huh? And I need to figure out which office it's going to be before Momo gets me. So that's going to be the most terrifying part about this game. And I felt like Momo knew exactly where I was when she spotted me. So I guess the key here is don't even get spotted the first time because I guess she just automatically goes to you no matter what. Another note, it says put coffee in, put water in, press on complicated. You're complicated. Your mom's complicated. What? Okay. Is there anything for me here besides these batteries, mate? Besides these good old batteries, mate? Is that camera still here? Please? Yes. All right. This makes it a little bit better. I mean, not the best, but shit. It's better than something because if you take it off, there's a lot of darkness. But if you turn this on, you can zoom too. And then that way we can see Momo's ugly ass face. Well, let me just make sure I have everything I need. Okay. I think we're good. So this is where like the thunder started making my ass shake. Hey! I actually didn't even know that she came in. I thought that was just thunder, dude. Okay. Whatever. Whatever. Another note. Oh, God. <gasps> Holy shit. Bro, that's creepy. That's freaky Ziki. Okay, I do not like the way this looks. Hold on. Wait. Crouch down in the darkness. You all probably can't see anything. But... I kind of just want her to go away. Y'all see that big ass head? She can't see through walls. This is not like a one way mirror or a two way mirror or whatever. She could see. Wow, it opened up for her? I mean, obviously, right? I don't even know why I'm acting like it wouldn't open up for her. But she's going that way. So let me read this note. It says, Thanks for playing my game. You're probably the only one who read this post. You are awesome. Are you freaking kidding me, dude? Are you freaking shitting on my chest? I got a developer note. I need help. I need to get out of here. Okay. Let's go here. What's this? Uh. Okay, that's nothing. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Close this? Holy fuck. What? Um. I have no idea. <laughs> Shit. So I need a code for something. Great. Oh, man. This is actually kind of terrifying. What the heck? I thought it was going to be like some cute Momo game or something. But the only thing that's cute is nothing. Okay. Momo went that way. So let's check in here. Holy crap. I give you the code for my safe, but don't share it with anyone. And above all, destroy this paper once you have read it. I count on you. Okay, so it's 2609. Okay, Momo's gone. Go this way. And what door is it? It's this one. Okay. 2609, everybody. 2609. Six. Zero. And. Nine. Give me some. Open up. Open up. Why are you not opening up? Open sesame. Open sesame. Alakazam. What the fuck? Oh, there's a key card already in my inventory. Use this to open a locked door. Okay. So, let me get the fuck out of here. Let's do this. Oh, shit. Okay. So, I'm gonna run. Because fuck this. Go. Go. Whoa! Shit. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Come on. Where? Go, go, please. I have no stamina. I have no stamina. I'm dead. I'm dead. I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know. Oh, great. Just freaking great. So we got out of there, but we still got clapped in the end. Thank you for playing. Last game of today's episode is called The Pale Man, and I kind of feel attacked right now because I too am a pale man. But we are going to see how pale this man actually is because the pale man is portrayed as the bad guy in this game. And me, um, I'm just going to go medium. Like, I like my steak. I like it medium. I like it medium well. I don't like seeing blood, 
but I don't like it too dry because the more cooked it is, the tougher it's gonna be. It's gonna be tougher than a $2 steak. Oh no, did I fall asleep on this bench? Yeah, you did because you a little bitch. I have no complimentary horror game flashlight. I should get home now. Why is a creep falling asleep in the middle of a park? This dude's a weirdo. He deserves to get killed by the pale man. I'm actually on the pale man's side. There's a suitcase here with a combination that I obviously don't know. And let's see what we got over here. Pale man? There better be a pale man here. And he better be super pale. Because if not, I'm punching somebody in the face. All right, hopefully I have an unlimited sprint. How do I get home? Oh my God! Okay, that freaked me out. What the heck? Oh shit, I'm dead. Yep, there's no escaping that. Why are there so many bear traps in the middle of buttfuck nowhere? He is a pale man. He's paler than a ghost. Oh, I can actually go through the trees. Sweet. Okay. The pale man's not gonna stop. He's not gonna stop coming for these cheeks. Oh goodness. Okay, how do I outrun this bitch? Why is he so horny for me? All I did was fall asleep in a park bench. God damn it. Okay. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. All right, whatever. Kill me. Dude, touch the top of my head. That's all he did. Oh, no. Did I fall asleep on this park bench? Swing. Wow. Let's never do that again. All right. So a pale man is obviously wandering around for no reason. I'm just going to go through here. Let's see what happens. Pale man! Oh, pale man! No pale man here. All right. So far, so good. Okay. So there's no pale man. There's a lot of fog, though. <laughs> it hurts! Oh, the steam hurts! Yeah, I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What's this? Flowers. Oh interesting i need a shovel for this why don't you just go home why are you doing these random freaking side quests what's in here oh! <laughs> okay <laughs> okay somebody's played roblox doors there's some seeds there um that actually scared the shit out of me though but yeah i need a shovel for that all right lights flickering for no reason huh i'm confused I don't know what you want me to do, game. What the hell is this? Bro, dead as shit. 482? Oh, I didn't even need to strain my neck for that. Bro got clapped. All right, he got clapped by the pale man. I mean, the pale man is weak as shit. All he did was tickle the top of my dome. So if he did that to you, you bitch made. I actually kind of want to die so I can start off from the beginning. But I don't see where that suitcase would be. It was kind of a little bit in front of the park. Wait, so here's the park. So the suitcase is right here. Okay. 482. So four. Shit. Eight. Two. But I fucked up with the four. There you go, baby. And we got a key. So now we have the key in our inventory. I think we got to go back to that one little shack where the spider got me. So let's see if I can find it. This is so damn random. I don't even know where the hell I saw it at. Is it right here? No. Okay. If the pale man sees me, it's pretty much a wrap. Oh, there you go. I found it so quick. All right. Oh, God, no. God damn it. Okay. I don't know how to get him away. Wait. Can we trap him with the bear trap? Hold on. Walk over here, you bastard. Oh, what the? Okay. All right. He just walked right over here. He just walked right over it. Okay, we just walking over bear traps now? What the hell is this? Bro, over here just walking over bear traps like shit's really sweet. Can't believe I have to input this thing again. Why was that person even there with a suitcase anyway? Brought a suitcase just to get clapped, my boy. All right, so now that we have the key again, and before I was so rudely cock-blocked, let's go. I think I went this way, just like a diagonal. Like a 1 a.m. diagonal. It doesn't even matter, 1 a.m., 1 p.m., whatever. I think it was like right here? Wait. What the hell? What the heck? Hold on. The shack was not too far from here. Okay, that guy died right there. Where the fuck is that shack? We have to be careful though. I think the pale man just kind of walks along the sidewalk. Because the pale man's trying to be like super safe with it. 
I don't know. Where the hell is this bitch? Pale man? Where art thou, pale man? Pale man? Oh, pale man! Fuck you. I'm dead. I'm dead. Yep, I'm dead. Okay. Alright. Okay, alright, alright, okay. I don't know how to get rid of this bitch. Maybe if I just keep going, like, in weird directions? Let me see, let me see. Oh, there's the freaking shack. Oh, you're such an ass muncher, dude. Fuck. Wait. Oh. That makes sense. Okay. Let me see. Let me see. What the fuck? What the heck? Close the door. Um, I found the shovel. What the hell? He couldn't follow me in here. You know what? Fuck this. Run! Okay. We have to dig up the thing. Go, 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 go. This is so freaking random. I don't even know the origin story of the pale man. What was it? Like one day a pale ass man just decided he ain't really about that life and decided to be a villain to the entire world? Like what the hell is this? What is this shit? Okay. Come on, 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 come on. This should not have me sweating on my back like this. Like, I have sweat dripping down my ass crack. This is so disrespectful. Come on, Jay. We got this, buddy. We got this, pal. We got this, buddy, old pal. If another spider pops up, I'm done. Nothing? Okay. Stop doing that. Stop making that weird-ass noise. Shit. What? What is that? Another key. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Give me that. Oh, a gun, too? Hold up. <laughs> Wait. You know what I'm saying? Well, hold up. Give me one second. One second. All right, where you at? Where you at, pale man? Let's go. Oh, you scared now, huh? Oh, that's what we do. Okay, hold on. I kind of want to kill this sucker. One second. Actually, wait. You know what? I got it. I got it. Let me do the bolt cutters real quick. Oh, no. Oh, man. I kind of wanted to open the gate and then wait for him. You managed to escape. But the pale man will still haunt your dreams forever. Not on my watch. All right. So we are going to open this bad boy back up. And let me get that gun real quick. And then we get the bolt cutters. So now that we have everything that we need, I am going to kill this bitch. And nobody's going to tell the police about it, all right? We're all in this together. You're going to help me bury the body. I'm sorry for putting that pressure on you, everybody. But I mean it, though. I mean it. Like, if I'm getting rid of the body, you keep your mouth shut, all right? That's all that matters. That's all that matters in this world. Is keeping your word and wording your keep. Bitch! You thought! You thought! Yeah, you thought! Oh, yeah, baby! Uh. A couple extra dome shots. You managed to kill the pale man and escape for now. Yeah, like I said, everybody. For now means until the police come. But as long as we keep our mouths shut, this pale man's secret will be ours forever. All right, everybody, but that's going to do it for this episode of Free Random Games. Hope you all enjoyed this episode. So if you did, make sure you give it one big fat like and tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude!